So, let's get cracking. Yo, what's going on guys, it's Jack here from Budget Movies, and welcome back to LS Bounty Hunters, or Los Santos Bounty Hunters. And today, ladies and gentlemen, we'll be going after the E. Cola and Sprunk team. Mz. Teams. <laughs> um, there's this new trend that's been going around recently, and we've been getting complaints about the E. cola and the sprunk morphs being worn and shown in battles so we're just gonna patrol the streets see if we can find any and yeah unfortunately Ryan will not be joining me today as he's gone to the caravan but we'll just we'll just roll with it okay alright let's do this Alright. This is 10-4, I've spotted a couple of sprunks in the area, over. Copy that. Okay, no one's there. Okay, I'm gonna get in my van and I'm gonna... I'm gonna follow these two. I've already got a bit of a head start, but I should be able to find them easily. It's a bright green van we're looking at. <clears throat> this is 10 4th. I've spotted those two sprunks. They, they appear to be in a green sprunk van. Over. Copy that, agent. I see they've already met their target again. The LSP, he's um, dealing with them, I guess. <laughs> Alright, I got them. Now I gotta run. <laughs> I'm just gonna run. I'm gonna call Lester real quick. This is 10 4th. Both targets have been neutralized. Over. Copy that. I'm guessing you don't want a back rub. How can I help? I take it this isn't purely a social call. Of course not. You're in trouble and you need my help. No problem. Alright. Now that we've gotten those out of the way, let's continue. We've got some crazy drivers on the roads. You're an 
nothing new. Alright. Okay, that's that's that out of the way, I guess. And guys, just to clarify, um, I didn't kill the Sprunk for no reason, it's just because, well, I'm not picking either side, so if I see either team fighting, they're going down. I don't care. But me and Ryan, as Los Santos Bounty Hunters, we are specially trained to take down people like these. So whenever someone approaches us like that, then we know what to do. And I know I'm not putting on my usual voice today, but you know what, screw it. It's my channel, my choice. Just in case anyone's wondering. You might have noticed this street from the first episode, or rather, last episode, <laughs> the pilot. <clears throat> Oh, and um, we have an official outro now, so that'll be playing at the end of the episode. So that's good. There's a lot heading heading your way um, this this year on budget movies. Um, there will be a special episode of Ellis Bounty Hunters coming out on Monday. Because it is the 29th of August on Monday, and little does anyone else know on on my channel know that it is my birthday. So, well, mo most of you will know who are, what that means on Monday, but um, for those of you who don't know, it is my birthday, as I've just explained. But yeah, we're just going to make a quick park in in here and we're gonna see if my spin of the day is ready probably not but we'll have a look anyway alrighty Um, I'm gonna go up to casino. Later. Okay, we're back. <coughs> <laughs> I've never known a cough in a video like that before. I don't think I ever have coughed in a video before. But, um, we're gonna try again. If it doesn't work, then, well, we're screwed, basically. But we're gonna try our best. Let's go. Meow. Whoa. Meow. Just realized as well, we've got less body cam footage in this. <laughs> I don't know if anyone really wants to see body cam footage, but here it is. Or action cam, or whatever you want to call it. Ah! My car just spiraled out of control. And now I'm carrying a lamppost with me. 
Yeah, my car doesn't have not a single scratch on it. That's cool. Cool beans. Woo! Now that was cool. I'm good at I'm good at crashing and I'm good at finessing at the same time. I can't I can't be trusted with my friends' cars. Okay, let's find ourselves some sprunks. We get more sprunks than e colas here. Which is weird because we haven't spotted not one e cola a day. We've spotted like three sprunks today and that's pretty much it. This is 10 fourth. We've spotted no perpetrators today, I and mean, I've just crashed over. God, that voice cracked though. Over. Um, we're gonna pull out the air force, I think. Show you guys what's going down. Hello, Pegasus Lifestyle Management. How can I help you? Your beautiful new aircraft is waiting at our nearest airfield. We hope you're very happy, sir. Okay. Okay. Let's do this. We've got our plane in. Not that plane. This is our plane. I think. Yes, it is. Look at that beauty. Just makes you want to kiss the surface. No, I'm joking, it doesn't. <laughs> right. I say we get in this bad boy. This is 10 fourth. I'm about to take launch in a jet over. Now we need permission to take off first. So I'm just gonna scoot around here. Don't know why he's screaming for. Okay. Alrighty. This is 10 fourth requesting permission to take off over. Copy that agent. You have been granted permission to take off over. Thank you, over. Alright. And away we go. Let's do this. Never actually flown a plane before. Well, I have. Just not a jet. We can go upside down though. So that's cool. Never actually um, flown upside down before in a plane. The thing about these jets though is that you can nosedive, pick up speed, and then go faster. But these sorts of planes are best to be in the air at all times, like high up, 
but I doubt that's ever gonna happen today. So yeah. Just so as you guys know. Camera sort of glitched there for a second. Alrighty. This is 10-4th, we're having a smooth flight up here over. Now one thing I've known not to do in these sorts of planes is to never fly over the military base. Because that is very bad. Right, let's try and land this bad boy. Oh, we landed. That couldn't have been a more perfect landing. I'm very impressed with myself. But I think we're better off with helicopters. Yeah. Just a bit. Alrighty. Let's see if we can fly back without blowing up. <laughs> right, let's do this. Body cam is on, and we're gonna try in and fly our way back home. it's much easier flying a helicopter because then you don't have to worry about crashing much because you're in the air all the time also these types of helicopters can only go a certain distance so I'm gonna try like I'm gonna try and make this journey as short as possible but hopefully hopefully we'll be able to just go back like just go straight back to the airport. Ugh. Yawn it a day. I woke up early this morning. Never thought I'd be doing this today though. Never thought I'd be flying a jet and a helicopter. As well as driving a ute. Or as Ryan calls it, a hummer. I think we're gonna wrap this um, video short for now. We've caught our suspects anyways. We've caught about three of them a day, so that's that's pretty much our daily amount. Um, there, there hasn't been much, there hasn't been many aggressors today, so I think I'll just drop this one up as soon as we land. getting closer to the location now. This is 10 4th in the sky again with a helicopter. We're approaching landing area. Over. Copy that.
Now one thing I've learned is that these do not work like planes. Hang on a sec. Okay, we successfully landed. That's the first time I've actually ever landed a helicopter without it blowing up. And like what happened earlier. Yeah, not the best thing in the world, like. But anyways, here's our Hummer, all safe and sound. And I think it's best to wrap this video up now before it's too late. So, thank you guys so much. For watching this hunt it was a solo mission but we managed to successfully grab everything we needed and uh, make sure you like and subscribe and turn the bell icon share with a friend and comment your favorite part of today's hunt and as always thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next hunt good day So, let's get cracking.